Hey everybody, welcome into another edition of I Can't Even, and I can't even believe that it's been 20 years since Tiger Woods won his first major. That's right, Augusta, 20 years ago. He won by 12 strokes and thus took the entire golfing world by surprise and dominated for a good 10 to 12 years. And to commemorate uh, the upcoming Masters Tournament, Tiger Woods showed up on Good Morning America, where he had a really nice putting competition with Michael Strahan, because, you know, nothing says, like, I'm ready to get back and be competitive, like putting on fake grass in a studio against Michael Strahan. Uh, but he did make the putt. He did beat Michael Strahan, and the entire world wants to know whether or not Tiger Woods is going to be playing in a couple of weeks at Augusta. I, however, have a completely different question that I would like answered. Uh, my question has to do with what in the fuck have you been doing with all this downtime that you have had? You look 76 years old. He looks terrible. He looks like my seventh grade science teacher. It's awful. What the hell happened to you? You're only 41 years old, Tiger, and you look like an old man. Father Time has kicked your ass, my friend. So my big question, Tiger, isn't whether or not you're going to show up on the golf course. My big question is, what's been going on, man? Like, what has happened to you? Also, what's going on with the hair? Like, you've got to make a decision. Like, people close to you have to be going, listen, Tiger, you're either sticking with the hair or you're getting rid of the hair. You, you can't do the whole half on, half off, wax on, wax off thing. You got to make a decision. I think it would look great if you got rid of it all. Scott Van Pelt, who is completely bald, had this interview earlier with Tiger Woods. And I've been telling you, bro, for a long time, I am your GPS, and I just want to know uh, what, are, what, are, what are we going to just, when are we going to just come home, man? It's, it's, it's time to come home. <laughs> I I know I get it I get it you know we <laughs> look we are at not me brother look at me I know I get GPS. it I get it <laughs> no I hey I I've got my hello pad up top and I'm I'm very happy with that okay. I just can't get over looking at him, just how terrible he looks. He, he, he's blown up like a tick. He looks like he's got some sort of gluten allergy. I don't know what to make of the whole Tiger Woods thing. But I do know this, Tiger, and I beg of you and I am asking you, please, in a couple of weeks when the Masters rolls around and Augusta comes calling, please do me a favor and don't answer the phone. Do not show up at Augusta. We cannot handle a couple of rounds of you looking like that and then wiping your ass one day and throwing out your back and then all of a sudden you can't complete the round. It's just, it's a recipe for disaster. So I beg of you, please take a year off, take two years off. As a matter of fact, with the way you look, you can probably get yourself on the Champions Tour right now and play with the Bernard Longers and all the other 60 and 70 year old guys because really that's where you look like you belong please don't go to Augusta please stay away from the Masters we want to enjoy the young guys coming up now the Jason Days the Dustin Johnsons the Rory McIlroy's the Jordan Spieths you were great Tiger there was nobody better but with the way you look now and I just nobody wants to see that in a couple of weeks at the Masters. So do us all a favor, Tiger. Number one, figure out what the fuck you're going to do with that hair. And number two, wait until the Champions Tour. It's just around the corner. I can't even with how he looks.